Hello YouTube, uh, Mike here. Um, the sun is just getting ready to go down uh, here in Phoenix and it oh, feels like it's probably about maybe 90 something degrees out right now, maybe 94, 95 degrees. A little bit humid but I'm going to be setting up the telescope, going to do a little bit of fast motion. Some people were interested in the uh, how I set up the scope and everything so I'm just going to go ahead and do that and uh, oop, there's a bug on here and uh, do it in fast motion and we'll see how it turns out. Here we go. Basically what I've done is I've already done my two-star alignment uh, with the telescope and um, I've already started my program called Starry Night Pro. Now uh, what I've done is with this little COM port right here, which is a USB COM port, which uh, ties in that cable that you see right there, which then comes around and actually ties into the bottom of the handset right here. There's the next our GPS handset that's already in there. So what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to do a connect to it. So once I hit connect, it should show us. Right there is my mouse. Connect. It should connect up. It is connected. You see the number is just starting to go crazy because it's already connected, showing us our right ascension, the declination, the altitude, and also the azimuth. And there it is on the screen, which shows next star celestron next star gps 2.2 sorry if that's not in focus now what i do is i can uh, i'm going to go ahead and close this side of the window for right now just to give me more room on here i'm going to point this uh screen is actually going to make it go to north is what i'm going to do and then when it goes to north as it's thinking i'm going to find polaris which is right here i'm going to right click it and then you'll see the very top choice is SLU 2 Polaris. So if I click that, it automatically tells the telescope. Turning and going towards Polaris. Maybe back off a little bit here. And away it goes. It's going to go find it, and it's going to have a little happy time finding it. I love this video. And there it is. It has found Polaris. And then, uh, let's see a different star here. We're going to slew the fur cab. 
it goes. And it's already found it. That is it. And there you go. That's the, uh, I'm not doing any uh, nighttime photo or uh, any uh, astrophotography um, tonight, uh, so I don't have it on the um, uh, equatorial wedge, uh, which only allows just one motor to be used instead of the two motors for less vibration, but uh, I'm just going to do some viewing tonight of the moon and a couple of other small things, and that's it. So I just put it on the basic tripod, hook it up right up into the laptop, and she's good to go. And that's it. I'm going to go uh, enjoy some viewing. See you later. Bye.